Throwback Thursday, McGregor Muirfield Irons. Not the 20th anniversaries, the old school, the 78, 79, pure butter. McGregor Muirfields, old school course test. All right. Um, I'm hitting some really good shots with these. They're the smallest blade I've ever played. You know, I got the Myura Baby Blades, and these things are smaller than the Myura Baby Blades. They remind me of the 1955 McGregor's. Very small, um, extra muscle in the back. Sweet spot is more toward the heel. Now, let me tell you, I'm a blade player, but I had to really trust on my premium setup and secure my strike. It made me appreciate the premium setup even more because there is no room to be sloppy with a shot with a club like this. But the reward is a magnificent feedback. The sound is amazing. And the ball flight is something you just don't see. You just don't see it. All right? But it's a great club. For you guys that got the old school 1960 and 1970 McGregor VIPs, they're the exact same mold as the daggone old school McGregor Muirfield. Not the 20th edition, 20th anniversary. I'm talking about the pre 20th anniversary, okay? All right? The only thing they did at the end of the process was put different stampings on them between the VIPs of the 60s and the 70s and the McGregor Muirfields. Wonderful club right here. Curtis Strange won two US Opens with these clubs in his bag. But like I said, it made me depend on my premium setup just to secure my strike even more. Piston pivot, anchor your weight, swing along the body line. Look at that ball. Lasers. I'm loving it. I'm going to hit some two irons, some wedges, and shots like that, and then post this video. Take care, folks. Look how beautiful that club is. Look at that right there. Any decent golfer should be able to play a bladed six, seven, eight, nine iron pitching wedge. But the tail is right here, the long irons. Two, three, four iron. Miura, I mean, I'm sorry, McGregor. Muirfield. This is the smallest blade I've seen, even smaller than my Miura baby blades. Two iron. Let's put it to the test. Beautiful. That's on the front of the green with an old school 40 year old club blade. Can you see me, folks? I'm going to actually take you up here on this one and show you that. That's two iron. Old school. I was only about 225, 230 out. You know, and I'm thinking with this these lofts, it has to be a two iron. You know, with today's loss, you may get a three iron there. But I'll take that all day long. I mean, penetrating, penetrating ball flight. Penetrating ball flight. Oh, right off the, on the first cut. We still take this. On the first cut. Not bad. Right there. Actually, that's on the first part of the green. Okay, the green starts here, so not bad. Hey, folks, I mean, you know, they're not for everybody, but for the person that loves traditional clubs, go for it. These McGregor Muirfields are amazing. I'm telling you, they're probably 40 years old at least, but they're just as solid as my Marrera Baby Blades and my Mizuno MP20s. These are solid. A full club and a half shorter, 
So I gotta get them spec to see what the loft is on them. But I'm telling you, they're, they are stout. Small blade, sweet spot more toward the heel. If you got the game for them, you will love them. Look at that ball right there. Just penetrating bullets, wow. Final shot of the day with the McGregor Muirfield Classic Clubs. Man, I am totally impressed. Let's make this a good one. They have made me work today. I didn't hit, I didn't hit no bad shots, but I really had to work to hit the good ones. I mean, it makes me want to say, hey, these are going in the bag, but you have to work. But the reward is just, I mean, did you see that ball flight? Amazing.